Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Mac Shoots Film. Okay, this is a continuation of the shooting film in the Southwest series. The last episode, I was in Death Valley and it suddenly ended. A really bad windstorm moved in through the valley last night. I was in Furnace Creek or something like that. Anyway, it was about nine o'clock at night. The tent just started leaning sideways, collapsing onto me. I laid there for about an hour and I looked around and literally my entire tent was filling up with dust. I had about probably that much dust in it before I decided, okay, I'm gonna sleep in the car. My air mattress had popped the night before, so I slept in the back seat uh, in the fetal position. It was terrible. I was supposed to stay in Death Valley today, but the wind is continuing. Sustained winds over 20 miles an hour, gust in the 50s. That's too much out in the sand, guys, way too much. So. I'm supposed to meet my girlfriend on Friday. Today is Wednesday. I decided to go ahead and come to Vegas. I was gonna meet her in Vegas on Friday. So I'm here and I can't check in till three o'clock. So I decided why not go to the Hoover Dam and that's where we're at now. Uh, here I'll be running the Leica M6. No batteries still. Uh, using my phone to meet her and I'll be using the Mamiya 6 folding camera. It's really windy out here, so probably won't talk too much. That wind that I was experiencing, Death Valley, apparently is here as well. Not as intense, but it's pretty crazy. All right, guys, I'm going to walk around, just snap some shots, kill some time. Hope you enjoy the episode. I'll see you at the end. Just like that, I'm back in Arizona. Arizona state line. And those towers over there are the Nevada state line. What's cool is cars can drive right on top of the Hoover Dam. Check that out. That car's driving up. This bridge last time I was here wasn't complete. That's gotta be insane to go across. All right, I'm gonna keep walking around. Check out this view, guys. What a beautiful day. It is crazy windy out here. There's a break in the wind, so I thought I'd chat with you. I'm just shooting the M6, and I actually got a scratch across my rangefinder patch. So it makes it even more difficult. Not only is the battery dead now, I have a scratch across my rangefinder patch. I'm overcoming so much adversity, guys. I'm gonna be the most resilient human being when I'm done with this trip. All right, guys, let's keep walking. There she is, boys and girls. The world famous Hoover Dam. Dam, that's a massive dam. Look at that. Shooting 35 millimeter feels like an endless roll. You know, my Pentax 6.7 only had 10 shots per roll. I keep clicking the shutter and go to advance thinking it's gonna stick, meaning it's out of shots, but nope, 35 millimeter, the roll that keeps giving. This was not my first trip to the Hoover Dam, but definitely my first time there shooting film. Ever since I've started shooting film, I insist on shooting film on all of my trips. I may only be there one time, and I really love the idea of the negative that I can hold my hand was there with me. The air that I breathed into my lungs wrapped itself around that film. The sun that fell on my face kissed the front of that negative. Is that romanticizing film? Absolutely. Is that okay? You're damn right. Uh, I shot Pro Image 100 at 50 ISO just because the sun was so terrible, not expecting to get any portfolio images. And I just had a great time. Now it was time to head to Vegas. This right here is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> How many showers am I gonna take? What? Oh my God, I'm the nastiest motherfucker you've ever seen right now. 
<laughs> After a much needed shower, I decided to kill a few hours and walk around and take uh, a few shots of how empty Las Vegas was. I was shooting Kodak Gold 200 and Pro Image 100 and nothing really spectacular, but here are some of my favorites. And that's a wrap for today's episode. Thanks so much for watching. Next week, we're going to a really cool place, Nelson's Ghost Town, just outside of Las Vegas, Nevada. This is an absolute film photographer's dreamland. Uh, it was so much fun. See you next episode. Thank you.